or ASD Life. Hello, it's me, Jackson. Today, I, me and my family are in Newburgh, Oregon. So we're walking, we're walking on the railway tracks. Why are we walking on the tracks, Jackson? Because it's what me and Grandma like to do. So you came out to visit Grandma? Yeah. So tell us about the tracks. So they are really old and rusty, as you can see. And they haven't, and this part hasn't been used in a long time. Yeah, and this section of track. And a few days ago, my Grandma saw a locomotive headed that way and then come, and then back up. Cool. It looks like over there is where it stops. All right. And it looks like they don't use this part anymore. What kind of trains do you think ran on these tracks? I maybe freight trains. Okay. And did you know the rails they come off like balance beams? Oh, are you gonna? Help me? I, I never mind. Whoa. Whoa. Oh. Okay. So these are the wooden railway ties. Okay, that's what those are called? Yes. Those are the wood and then here's some nails. So they so they lay the rails down onto the wood and then they nail, they nail the rails down so trains can run on them. Cool. Yes, and so all the time walk on the railway tracks that's fun yep it really is it's a beautiful day too yep it's a beautiful saturday afternoon okay anything else whoa <laughs> anything else you want to tell your viewers Which, well, this is an example of one. So this is one of your favorite things? Yep. My favorite thing to do in Newburgh. Well, my second, my first one. Want to know what, viewers? What? So I always like to drive into downtown Newburgh and go to the Newburgh Fire Station. Oh. And once I took Justine there. Your cousin? Yeah, I took my cousin Justine over to that fire station and the firefighters gave us fire hats cool and i gave her a tour of the front and once me and grandma spent so much time there that we almost couldn't go the next day and there's lots of cool discoveries to find on old railway tracks even maybe lava rocks or something so as you know trains have not been on this kind of track for ages. Can't you see how rusty these rails are? Look how rusty those rails are. Remember, you got to stay kind of by the phone so that we can hear you. Okay, so as you know, these rails are so old. Trains don't even use this part of the track anymore. And look how many tracks there are. One. Four sets of track. Yes, four sets of tracks, folks. And so, there. So here's how these tracks form. I'll show you guys. I'll show my viewers. So do you see that switch up ahead? Hold on, I don't think we can hear you, bud. Do you, don't you see that switch up ahead? Oh, right there, yep. yep. So that's how each track turns into different tracks. It's kind of like a change in plans, like you're on this track, and then that's one of my strategies I learned with Miss Kitty, so here's what I'm just saying. So you see this track, the train was beautifully walking on this track, but then hey, there was a change in plans. Yep, so, so just like in life, 
trains have to change track and we have to change our tracks yeah. sometimes, huh? Here's an example like when my grandma was in the hospital and I was expecting my babysitter to come and she didn't and grandma was in the hospital and I don't like changing planes. If you have autism like me, you do not like changing in planes. Yeah, they sometimes. can be hard for anyone. Even with kids without autism, they can be hard. Yep. And another change in plans, I was watching one of my YouTube videos with my class and a fire alarm went off when I was just talking about. So what do you do when you have to change track or you have a change in plans? Well, you, it might take a little while to get used to while you're on that track. It might get a little while for you to get used to. Okay. But then after a long time, you get used to it. Oh, All right. Nap, mommy? I think that sounds great, bud. So sometimes in life, you have to change tracks just like a train. Sometimes yep. change happens, huh? So suppose your train that's running on tracks, really happy and really smoothly, but then there was a change in plans. Change in plans. Yep. I'm just demonstrating. Yeah, you're good at demonstrating. Okay, and so now you're on this new track, for example. Oh, we're supposing this was a few days later. I'm getting used to it. So I'm now getting used to this plan. Then here's one. I'm fit in fifth grade, and I'm about to get ready for middle school. Yeah. And so I will have to get up earlier, and I'll have to do more walking. And I can't talk a lot. So that'll be a change in track from elementary school, yeah. huh? Because I'm used to elementary school. Ooh, just ignore this, but there's Let's undoing. ignore that. Yep. Never know what you're going to find on the train tracks. Yeah. Well, so, I think it's time to let your YouTube viewers go, bud. Bye. I hope you watch more videos on our ASD life.